Hi, welcome to Prep With Me. My name is Sonia, and if you're new here, I'm so happy you tuned in. Hopefully you'll like what you see and become a subscriber. Now let's get started. We're gonna start our meal prep with something called sirkanis. It's a rice with chickpea dish. And the recipes will all be linked down below in the description box if you guys need any specifics. And if you guys have any questions at all, please leave it in the comment section down below at the, at the bottom of the video. And I'll be happy to answer anything. So as you see, I just uh, washed an onion, washing up my rice and I'm going to be uh, rinsing and draining out the chickpeas as well and adding it into a foil tray lined with parchment paper. So as I said in previous videos, I do most of my meal preps on Thursday nights and I finish up each meal on Friday right after work. So over here I had already prepared like seven crushed cloves of garlic in about a quarter cup of oil the night before. So all I had to do when I got back from work is to put it into a saucepan, heat it up until you start smelling that delicious aroma of roasted garlic. And then I pour that over the Sirkanis, the rice and chickpea dish. And it's quick and fast. When I get home, I don't have to sit there peeling gum, garlic, crushing it. It's all prepared for me the night before. Here I'm gonna be making osvo. It's a rice and lamb overnight stew that we eat on Saturday for lunch. And I food process everything from the onions, the carrot, the tomatoes, the apples. I process it all and put it into a pot with a quarter cup of oil.
For two cups of rice, I use four cups of water and I do this prep also Thursday night and nothing happens to the meal. I just literally come home Friday after work and I put that on the stove and it cooks up beautifully. Um, some people are surprised that I add in the water, water the night before, but I find it to not affect my osuo at all. Here I'm going to be frying some flounder. First I dip it into flour and then into an egg mixture that I put in salt, garlic powder, paprika and pepper. oven fries are always such a big hit they're very presentable when you're having company and they're just super delicious you slice them up into little french fry type style and then you season them with mostly any kind of seasonings that you prefer i just keep it simple with some salt and pepper and garlic powder you could also add paprika and drizzle it with a generous amount of oil and put it at 500 degrees and turn them halfway through and again cook them on the other side until they're nice golden and crispy.
roasted chicken recipe is another big hit in my house, especially when I have company. The chicken looks so beautiful with that beautiful brownish red color to it, crispy on the outside, and I like to present it with some uh, crushed up garlic and, and dill as well. these tips helped and I hope you enjoyed watching this video please give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment below thank you have a great weekend